So this is going to be how to adjust your aspect ratio if your screen is not displaying correctly. So right now we're in Nintendo 64. We're going to go to A Bug's Life and we're going to start the game. I've already gone in here and messed up the settings on purpose. So you're going to see that the picture is offset. I'm going to show you how to correct it. Usually it ends up this way if somebody goes in there by accident and starts you know, flipping switches and pushing buttons they shouldn't push. All right, so you can see that we're offset here, and you've got this black bar, and it's not quite right. Yours might be down here in the corner. It might look different, but either way, it's not right, okay? So I'm going to show you how to fix this. Give it a moment for the game to load up. All right, now you can really see it's screwed up. So you need to go into what's called RetroArch. That's where you're going to change your adjustments. So to get there, you're going to push this top middle button here and your coin button at the same time. And you're going to get a screen that looks similar to this, okay? Now, first thing you need to do is push your B button, which is right here. Your B button is always this one. Push B. Now you're going to see that we're highlighted here where the little alien is. We're going to go over to where the gear is. And you can see I'm using the number one joystick to move back and forth, okay? And you're going to scroll down until you highlight video. Oops, I went past it. Video, okay? You're going to hit your A button to select video. Now you're going to scroll down using your number one joystick until you see aspect ratio. See aspect ratio is lit up. Now we're going to use our joystick to go left and right to change this. Now you see every time I change it, the image changes. Okay. Now depending on, see it changed to 4.3. 16.9 depending on what size or configuration screen you have depends on what your selection should be that's why it's nice that it shows a display in the background of how your image is going to be so this is a 19 inch square screen we have on this particular model so I'm going to keep going until it looks correct this should be a 5.4 if I remember right so you can see here it keeps changing and the image keeps changing all right, 5.4, we've filled the whole screen, it looks normal. If you have a 20 inch wide screen, you're gonna to wanna to go to 16.9. Which watch, you're gonna see it come up here. Right there, see the 16.9? That's gonna be your wide screen. So if you have a 20 inch wide screen in your cabinet, that's what your setting should be if you wanna fill the whole screen. So we're gonna bring this one back to the 5.4. <clears throat> So once you're at the 5.4 or whatever fits your screen, just leave it there. Perfect. Now hit your B button to get out of there. <clears throat> Excuse me. Now what you need to do is use your joystick again to go over here to the little alien. And we're going to save this system. Save the system settings. So see where it says quick menu? We're going to select quick menu with the A button. And you're going to hit the joystick up once. And that's going to jump you to overrides. Hit the A button to select overrides. And you're going to scroll down to where it says save game overrides. You can hit the A button again. It should say right down here override saved successfully. Once that's done, you can hit your B button again to exit. Go back up to the top. Hit your B button to exit out of here. You can see we're still in the little alien. You're going to scroll down to the bottom. And you're going to select Quit Retro Arch. And hit the A button. That's going to quit the Retro Arch. And it's going to bring you back into your subcategory. You can see we're back in here for Nintendo 64. Now just to prove that it worked, or to confirm that it worked, uh, we're going to select the same game again, A Bug's Life. So select A. Let it load. And we should be back to normal. And don't touch any buttons while it's loading. Yes, don't touch any buttons while it's loading. See, my wife listens to me sometimes. Oh, selective hearing. <laughs> you can already tell that we're centered like we, we should be uh, before this was way over here. Now, the, what we just did is we saved it in this specific game. Okay, So if you have a problem in another game, you may have to do the exact same thing to correct it. Or what you can do is when we went into um, to save configuration, where it said save uh, for this game, you can also go two clicks above that, and you can click uh, where it says, um, I think it says 
I don't remember the exact wording for it, but it, 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 it saves for the entire system. And that should set it saved across the board for everything. So you can see we're back to normal here and everything's the way that it should be. Um, if you guys have any questions about this and you're not exactly sure or if it's not saving or not working for you, um, send me a message, let me know. I'll be happy to help. Okay. All done. All done? It's only five minutes and 25 seconds. Playing. I'm surprised. Have a good day.